everyone I am in serious need of a makeup declutter I haven't planned this video and I just feel like I'm in a sorting out mood so I'm just gonna go with it I've got all my makeup here beside me let me show you so here we go I have a random mug for my makeup brushes I don't think I'm gonna throw too many of those away I've got a couple of boxes a couple of leftover birch box bags I've got loads of stuff in and this little gold bag here as well so let's make a start shall we <laughs> I have been needing to do this for a long, long time and I feel like I have a lot of makeup but looking at it here, it's probably not as big as some other people's collections so whatever, I'm just going to go with it. I do think clearing out your makeup is important every now and then because as you can probably see, this is disgusting. Can you see that? That was my precious Dior lip gloss. I can't remember the proper name, but I love that. But I haven't used it for a while, and this is what happens. They go disgusting. So makeup does have a um, use-by date. Oh yes, it does. And especially as like I get birch box as well. I just I just seem to collect makeup like with different samples as well as like my normal makeup I buy every month. So. Yeah, I just really need to declutter all of this. Right, so basically I'm just going to have two piles, keep and throw away. That's as simple as it gets. So this Dior thing is going. I did buy this Clinique concealer a long time ago. Lovely concealer if you want to try it. It's this line, line smoothing concealer, but it's a little bit too dark for me, so that's going to go. If you haven't guessed, this might be a bit of a chatty video because I was actually supposed to be filming my Birchbox unboxing video right now, but I have had no news of when it's arriving. I haven't even had the tracking email. Um, so yeah, I'm a bit annoyed about that. So I thought I'd qu very quickly clear out some of my makeup whilst I got a spare half an hour. Okay, um, oh god, I bought that from Kiko a long time ago. Is this still okay? Oh, yes, surprisingly enough it is. So yeah, sometimes you can have very old makeup. Um, I mean, I, I think that's at least a couple years old but sometimes it is okay it can keep one of the ways you can actually check and see if your makeup might be out of date is that um let me find oh yeah on here they always have like a little tub um symbol i suppose and like a time in there so this um master contour by maybelline this is actually 24 months they suggest before you should kind of throw it out but yeah it might again it might be fine after 24 months i actually find that i don't use this a lot so i might just throw it away anyway plus i don't really do a lot of chatty videos on my channel so i thought it might be nice um i i say i have a spare half an hour because really after a half an hour i've got to leave the house i'm gonna go see bohemian rhapsody at the cinema with my friend which i'm really looking forward to so i really gotta kind of do this quickly ico fat eyeshadow sticks by the way i haven't used it for a long time but they're pretty good i'm hoping this is still okay yeah that looks all right they're really cool i want to get some more of them and that's only two things i'm keeping so far yeah like i was saying makeup has different shelf lives i think mascaras have the least amount you're only supposed to have mascaras for about three months i don't always stick to that rule so you know i'm not judging anyone if they do and plus like looking through makeup you kind of forget which what like what kind of stuff you have again like i forgot all about these lip liners but i don't use them a hell of a lot i might keep them just in case I need them but everything else I'm going to be ruthless. Oh, another product I really like and I definitely want to get more of is the Urban Decay Heavy Metal Glitter Eyeliner. I, I bought this a little well a little while ago it was a couple of years ago for a wedding and um, I just used it to put over my eyes like an eyeshadow and seriously it stayed all day. So I'm keeping that. Mm. It's quite sad really when I get a lot of um, birch box stuff and sometimes I don't use it. I, I can always tell if it's a good box if I take out everything from the box and actually try it once at least. If I don't use it at all then it's a bit like, oh I don't know if that was a very good box. Lipsticks can go quite out of date as well. I mean it says on this Rimmel one 30, 30 months which is quite a long time but sometimes when I go back to an old lipstick it can be quite drying. I think this Kate Moss one definitely is too dry. Another lip liner I probably haven't used. <laughs> I don't know if I want to open that. Right, okay, what I've been meaning to do as well, this is why I wanted to do my makeup clearing um, out declutter thing, because I use the same makeup mostly every day, and I hate going through in my different bags and trying to pull out that every day. So I'm trying to get the makeup I definitely use, you know, Monday to Friday at work and just 
keep it all in one bag which I think I have been doing but even even that I think needs sorting out so at the moment I am using I'm just going to pick everything out at random by the way this is the East Saint Laurent all hours concealer really liking this concealer at the moment I always use real techniques brushes usually for my face makeup oh eyeshadow I am being using a mixture I've been using every now and then the Tarte palette I got in Florida my two beloved naked one and naked three palettes and I've got um, naked two basics but I've also got another naked like basics one somewhere as well but these are great like I use them every day and I was so sad to hear this week that naked one is being discontinued like I just don't get why they've got so many useful colors in there I just I don't understand I'm keeping all of those I always use my shoe Amora um, eyelash curlers they're absolute um, godsend for curling eyelashes it needs a bit of a clean load I want to show you too much I sometimes use this um, body shop vitamin C skin reviver instant smoother that's really lovely it's kind of like a primer but not it just smooths out your skin um, I'm, I'm using a mixture of two different eyeliners actually um, Monday to Friday if I'm not doing too much of a flick I'll just pick up my Ico London skinny eyeliner liquid eyeliner I got this in my birch box ages ago I'm actually surprised it's still you know it's lasted me till now but on the weekends I want I'm kind of given a try the Kat Von D tattoo liner I've got to admit I'm not used to it yet because it's quite a long nib at the end if you can see so you've got to be kind of careful with it but my god it stays on all day <laughs> mascara I'm wearing at the moment is the Clinique high impact curling mascara quite nice it is a tube in mascara so it doesn't smudge um, and you do have to wash it off with water at the end of the day instead of makeup remover. On my face every day I use the Caudalie Fino Perfect Radiance Tinted Moisturiser. My favourite tinted moisturiser. It's so nice. Oh, I've just seen it up against the light and I think I'm over halfway now so I might have to get a new one soon. Blush I'm wearing is the Gold Rush Blush from... Um, benefit again I got it in my birch box so that's why it's only a sample one I'm definitely gonna buy the full-size one when that runs out okay right that's that bag done oh and um, Dr. Pawpaw amazing on your lips really moisturizing see I can see a few things in here but I need to chuck away I had this Clinique moisture surge uh, tinted moisturizer it's all gone I don't know why I've kept it in my makeup bag again <laughs> mega lash from oh what who is this by is this by model co that's a really nice mascara as well it doesn't smudge it's completely dried out now so I don't know why I've got it oh my word can I just talk briefly about this makeup forever finishing powder I think it's called I have never tried a finishing powder this good before like honestly like when you put it on your it just smooths out your skin your skin actually feels different to touch it's so good this is actually a sample size and it came in a gift set which my friend got me for my birthday i think and it's just opened my eyes up to makeup forever like i know it's an awful brand name but i think that stuff is so good i really want to get some more makeup forever stuff like concealer maybe and foundation i think they're supposed to be both very good okay so that's one of my old old birchbox bags empty um, another way to clean out your makeup bags because they can get really grimy I'm, I'm sure you know what I mean by grimy but I might actually put these in the wash just to give them a bit of a wash and clean them out before I put my makeup back in them sadly I think I'm gonna have to throw away my beauty blender I think beauty blenders definitely have a shelf life as well because this one is just not cleaning up the way it used to you might be able to see how dirty it is on camera I don't want to get it too close to show you um, but yeah it just doesn't clean up as well anymore so I need to get a new one another makeup for everything the glosses oh my word they're so good oh hula bronzer Jesus Christ I can't believe I didn't try the benefit hula bronzer until last year and yeah it's the best bronzer I think I've used oh my god I keep on saying oh my god picking things out but oh my god this is my favorite ever mascara I can't believe I've never done a video on it before but it is the Dior iconic no sorry let me start again Di Dior Show Iconic Overcurl Mascara. It is literally my favourite mascara. I'll have to do a video on it sometime to show you. It just keeps your eyes curled all day and it's quite volumizing as well and oh, yes, love it. 
Okay, I think I'm done. That was rather quick. I hope you've liked this very chatty video. Let me show you how much I'm keeping and how much I'm throwing away. So this pile here just in front of me, I am keeping all of this. This pile over here um, is everything to go in the bin. There's no point in me selling it or giving it to anyone, honestly, because it's just... Either, either there's nothing left or it's just not very nice to give away. So anyway, I feel quite accomplished now. I'm going to throw all of this in the bin, wash those makeup bags and put my makeup I am actually keeping somewhere else whilst I wash the makeup bags. Anyway, useless information. I hope you've enjoyed this very quick and chatty video. I need to get ready now to go see Bohemian Rhapsody. And yeah, I hope you have a good weekend. Bye.